I'm going to review the Algebra Quiz 20 problems. Uh, most people missed either 1, 2, or number 5, but I'm going to work out all the problems to show you. Probably if you missed number 1, it's because of reading. Um, it said one-sixth of the books had been sold, and there were 390 books left. Now that doesn't mean one-sixth of 390, or one-sixth of the total is 390. You have to think a little bit that one-sixth have been sold, so five-sixths are left. And so five-sixths of the total is what is left, and that is 390. So you would set it up as an equation, five-sixths of the total equals 390. And then you would multiply by your reciprocal. And when you do, you get 468 books. On number two, several people missed that. I don't know if you rushed through your conversions or not, but just be careful. Seven times 10 to the first and six times 10 to the nine. Down here, this is 2 times 10 to the negative 3, and 3 times 10 to the second. Let's switch pens. This isn't working. Okay, so if we put this together, this would be, um, these two together would be 7 times 10 to the uh, negative 7, and 6 times 10 to the 9 over... 2 times 10 to the negative 3, and 3 times 10 to the second, which gives us 6 times 7, 42, times 10 to the 2, over 6 times 10 to the negative 1. And we can cancel out. That gives us 7. We move this to the top. It says positive 1. And so the correct answer is B, 7 times 10 to the third. If we go to this one, we have RA, TA equals RB, TB. And we simply substitute the values in. RA is 2, RB is 5, and TB we substitute in 7 minus TA. And so TA just stays the same. So we have 2 TA equals 35 minus 5TA. We move this to the other side and therefore 7TA equals 35 and so TA equals 5. And TB is 7 minus TA so that makes TB equal to 2 and that is answer A. On number four, we should multiply by the least common multiple that five, two, and six will go into, and that is 30. So we multiply each one by 30, and that cancels and gives us six, this cancels and gives us 15, and this cancels and gives us five, and then we need to do distributive property. So when we do, we get um, 6a plus 18 minus 15 equals 10a minus 5. And so we want to subtract 3, subtract 3, subtract 10a, subtract 10a. When the dust clears, we have negative 4a equals negative 8. Therefore, A equals 2, and that is our answer. Now, if we look at the last one, first of all, uh, you might not set it up, not want to set it up or whatever. I'm going to do it that way, but it says odd integers. This has an even number. This has an even number. You can cancel those two answers out before you even get started. Now. When we actually set these up, we say x equals the first, and if they're even or odd, x plus 2 equals the second, x plus 4 equals the third. 
So it says the sum of the first and th third equals the sum of the second and 21. So it said first plus third equals second plus 21. And so we would have x plus x plus 4 equals x plus 2 plus 21. And this would be 2x plus 4 equals x plus 23. We'd subtract x, subtract x, subtract 4, subtract 4, and x would equal 19. And so the three numbers are 19, 21, and 23, which is answer C.